Kwa mugele kislot Chicha Kasi la makasi chami ne not Kasi la wonsha jine zama zucha chujot Banga buche nugu tuyazu kwe lu pape sa jot Asfunu kwa ni 925 in the spot Sikcha pela fache kasi feshi ni uba stop Kona tu kona Mwini ema kaya Ika malamdi guzi mkite bote A.K.A. Zimi Welcome to another episode of Undiscovered Baby on New North TV whereby all the local rappers they come through and tell us more of their music but of course ga ke tsama ke le mong ke tsama le gharebe ya motswana nwe nyana motswana di me hi zikita how are you good how are you i'm good thanks di me lang go ga e ke le bitse ke re di me tsebi pelo wa ko ga di kwela of course you can call me mama sniper now you tuned into undiscovered of course we've got a local rapper that's here to tell us a bit about his music with a tlo boza hore what be i in what is he cooking my guy what's your name Man. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Always, always. Uh, it's coming. I'm Hitman, Mr. CEO. Oh, Hitman, Mr. CEO. Welcome to the show, Mr. Oh. CEO. Oh. <laughs> uh, thanks for having me, eh? No. All right. Yeah. So, tell us, tell us about yourself. Hitman, Gima. Hitman, Gima. Uh, Hitman is a, is a musician. Yeah. Um, uh, raised in Deep Sloot, but I was born in Bumalanga, you know. Mm. Yeah, so I grew up here. I've been doing music since ever since. Oh, ever since I can remember. Yeah. But tell me, here's something. You know, I'm very curious. Mm -hmm. You hit me. Yeah. But what's about yeah. hit me? Sure. What's your real name? Mongsen. Mongisen. Yeah, Mongsen. Oh, so hit me, Ah, uh, before I uh, before I call myself hit me, mm -hmm. I'm just busy with uh, another name. Uh, what was the name? Stones are delicious. Oh, okay, <laughs> delicious. <laughs> you know, uh, but yeah, my late uncle who introduced me to hip hop, mm -hmm. uh, it was like, yo, man, you got hits, man. You know, oh, you got hits, like, man. Oh, I see you that. Hits, man. You know. I'm so you decided man. to be the hit man. Yeah, and then squashed the whole Stones are delicious part, you know. And then, oh. yeah. So, hit me now, tell me, when did you discover that you've got this talent of doing music? I mean, you could have done like gospel in or what, la la diski, but you decided to, you yeah. know, who do music. Why? Why music? Like, when did you discover that? I was influenced by my late uncles. Oh, really? Yeah, Mzamazisi uh, and Naime Meza. They used to do music, so they are my uncles. So I grew up next to them, seeing them. And the records they will play, you know, hip hop music. What kind of music? Uh, that, that, you know, yeah. for you to be influenced by your uncles, that means they listen to old school music. Yeah. You're like your deep hip hop. Yeah. What kind of? Yeah. You know? <laughs> nah, nah. They used to do hip hop. Uh, they used to listen to hip hop, but even influenced by uh, R&B mm -hmm. and Guaido. Oh, know? keeping uh, it real. Yeah, keeping local. It raw. Yeah, okay. you know, so. Uh, your Tupac, mm. your Zola, mm. your Zambia, your Ashes, your, you know, I was in your Cisco, mm -hmm. Cisco. Yeah. Cisco. Yeah, Joe Hill. Cisco is from a long time ago, yeah. my guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> song, yeah. I was still a young one by then. Mm -hmm. So they used to listen to those, 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 those joints and I got the influence there. Mm -hmm. And they actually scouted me. Because I was more a hyper kid, you know. Mm. I wasn't shy. I wasn't. So they were like, man, um, don't you want to try this rap thing? You know, like, yeah, you, right, man. You, okay, so your first, the first, the very first time you you jotted down your lyrics, I want to know what was going through your mind. Was it that, okay, I'm just jotting down? Or how far can I go with this rap? Or okay, yes, by bang bang pile. Yeah, nah, or you got beef that. with another guy. Like, nah. what was going on for you to take that pen, put it to paper? Like the inspiration. What, what inspired you? My my uncles used to write for me first. Oh. You know, when I started, mm -hmm. so I would listen to those joints and like see how they do things, how they write, and then I would try it by myself when I'm alone, mm -hmm. and go test run it by him. Like yo, man, I just wrote this. What you think? You know, yeah. so we're gonna big up to the uncle mm. yeah, yeah, because yeah, yeah, now, yeah. like, he can probably say, Bona, yeah, I'm trust. doing this because Umalumi inspiring the Gashi Trust, Okay, so now, Hitman, I want to know is there anything that you are currently working on right now? Yeah, I'm working on my last mixtape. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, it's called Come Up Is Like Hell. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
Which so they should coming. watch the space. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I'm working on. But yeah, I just dropped a video now, deep mm -hmm. music video. Nice. Yeah. So you you, you represent in the hood. Yeah, man. Who knows me? Hitman. Yeah. To the viewers, this yeah. is a, I I've never done this in studio before, yeah. right? Yeah. Now I've heard a lot about him. So you wanna yeah. hear something? You know. So before we go for a quick ad break, <laughs> I just want you to drop a bar to just you know, uh, you know, get the hitman, get the You know, just give us a little something. Ah, uh, okay. Welcome, I'm going to get a little slow, deep down. Cause I'm a cause down in the north. Cause I'm a bunja and in the summer, so tattoo dot. I'm a bunja and look to ya, so to look pop is a dot. As for no bunja, nine to five in a sport. Zig jump ella faster, cause the fashion new bust dot. Corner to corner, bust name man, it's well in a port. Cleaning up, cleaning cats, I eat into anything I hold. Yo! Chilling no hit man. Can you have man Neo Salaman's opinion where? Because after the break, he's still gonna tell us more about his music. Stay tuned. Welcome back, Betulana Emakaya and Sasakeli no Hitman. And before the break, he was telling us more about his music. Yes, I was betting in your line. Even now, I'm still feeling hot, Betulana. So, now Hitman, I want to know, I'm very curious, like, what does your work aim? Like, what is is there a message behind your music like what are you like giving the to the people like i want to know the aim behind your music like what message are you sending out there the with is, your music the aim is to inspire you know mm. to inspire other young kids from from uh backgrounds like mine or mm -hmm. even worse than mine you know that you know it doesn't it doesn't matter where you're from. It's a, it's about where you're going, True. you know. And it's all in the mind, you know. So the aim is to inspire every time, you know, because mm. we we from Deep Slope, man, small township, yeah. you know, uh, been painted, but a lot of bad stuff. Yeah. You know? But uh, we still keep it going. There's there's this thing. There's a lot of nice things happening there. Mm. So many kids talented, you know. And there's young kids that are coming, you know, so we're trying to inspire them, mm. you know. Like Tupac has said, I might not make it, but I might spark, you know, the Some mind mm. that will make it. So yeah. I, might, I, might, I might not make it, but I might change a few kids' lives. I like that. Deep I like that. that. You know, it's possible. I like that. But now tell me, who, who, who are your biggest influences? You've spoken of your uncles. Now let's take... Your uncles out of the picture yeah. in the industry. I always look up to Tupac. Mm. I like Tupac. Dear Mama. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Tupac. Uh, yeah. I understand. And, yeah, the new the new kids at Tory Lanez. Mm -hmm. The new kid okay. from Toronto. Yeah. yeah Tory Lanez. I, I, I like him. Oh, okay. Wow. Yeah. So now Hitman, like you said, you like Tupac, right? Yeah. So now. The all kind of music that you're doing, I'd like to know that who would you like to collab with? Locally. 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 Local. <laughs> yeah. That's tricky. Ish. There's a lot, a lot of people. A lot of people. But, uh, top three. Top three. I would do Java. Mm -hmm. I would do Questa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I would do Kes. Kes mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, guess yeah. what I do with Mr. Hila? Yeah, you know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> which I thought you know, you're not going to keep Xing and. Uh, <laughs> but I have to give you my top three. Uh, yeah, top oh, three. Yeah. Top three. It, has, no, it has to be there. Yeah. Okay, tell me now. Upusha stuff is how guys, you know? Yeah. I get for now. I get for it. it. Yeah, okay. So, how do you price your work? If, say, oh, for example, yeah. so if, let's just say somebody asks to do a feature with you, Mukais. Yeah. Do you charge them? Or if somebody was to, if you were to blow up, yeah. how would you price your work? It depends, you know, some, some people you would charge them, but some people it's just organic, it happens, you know. So I mean, and I appreciate. prefer it like that. You prefer it like, like that? Yeah. Then right, it so needs now, to be like Hitman, how do you get your gigs? Yeah, I got, there's obvious there's people around me, you know, mm. like there's... People that know yeah, you. Know, so a word of mouth kind of thing? Yeah, there's people around me, like, meaning like there's a team. Oh! A team, oh, team okay. a few okay. guys. Excuse us! Team, <laughs> we <you know>? sorry! <laughs> 
Yeah, there's always people around you. Oh, so you've got somebody that there. does that for you. Not really, but people who okay. advises you and then will maybe give you contact sometimes. Oh, they will do it for you if they can do Not it for you. Man. But there's always people involved. No. I don't want to take all there's the always, I love the, the last word that you used. There's always people involved. Are you involved with someone? Me? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, so ladies, he's, he's naked. naked. <laughs> <laughs> would you like to send a shout out to baby? Yeah, man. Shout out to Magashara. Eh? Oh, Magashara. Magashara. Hello, hi. We've got your man here. Okay, now tell me. Give me a little bit of Sure. What's that thing y'all guys have in that red cup? In your music videos? The cup that you, the cup you always hold it. You know what is it? King H2O. Nah. Is it H2O? For me. Your percentage? <laughs> Which one? I don't drink alcohol. You don't drink alcohol? Yeah. Okay, no to alcohol. No to alcohol, no to drugs. Yeah. No to drugs. Yeah, yeah. What you got to say, Zimi? So now Hitman. Please tell the viewers there where can they get a hold of you when they want to listen more of you, where they can get you, like your handles. Ah, uh, it's music wise, you can get the music everywhere in every digital store you can think of. Mm-hmm. You can find our uh, music there. Mm-hmm. Uh, social media, like, uh, Facebook, Hitman CEO, Twitter, Instagram, Hitman CEO World, mm-hmm. TikTok, Hitman CEO. Oh, okay. the CEO. Yeah. I literally love a whole lot of hitman. Yeah, the hitman. You heard how he got influenced by who he got influenced by the music that he 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 he, he listens to. What else did he say? He get, he flowed, dropped a bit of bars. Kiri Dumit, Zimita, Hitman, undiscovered on Uno TV. If you'd like to follow us. On YouTube, please do do sub- subscribe. You know TV, Instagram, you know TV twenty five, Facebook, you know TV. Every single day, any day, any time, twenty four seven, three sixty five. We always. And also, there. if you are one of the rappers or artists you would like to join Hickman, like he did, you can also get us on our inboxes. I am Prudence Porter on Facebook and Mama Sniper. I'm Ritimeter Romana D Kola D I K O L A. Hickman. What's up? Sweet. What's up? Zimkito shop. Signing out. Peace out. Langu ya kona, langu ya kona. Nitsabo. Langu ya kona, langu ya kona. Nitsabo. Nitsabo.